Hi guys, Kelly here, and it is Ipsy Bag Month. Now, I've already recorded, or tried to record this video once, it didn't work, whatever. So, I did, I've already opened this, I've already got these, and this. So, uh, first off, says, New Year, New Products, More Focus on You. Lies. Uh, so it says, Welcome to our best year yet. We've got big changes coming our way, or your way. Here's a sneak peek at what 2019 has in store. So, fabulous new features. Uh, you can pick your passion. Now you can add up to three extra samples to your glam bag each month with add ons and score new fab full size deals with Glam Bag Plus, which I don't know what that is. Uh, new ways to personalize picks, more beauty brands you love insider tips and techniques actually they didn't put love they put a heart because that's now the international sign for love i thought it was the international sign of heart um when did we just stop using words and start using emojis all the time i miss the spoken word so this bag is really cute it's really classic um it's kind of country niche to me i really like it um the little pull tab is just a little piece of ribbon that's been knotted at the end. And yeah, I like it. It's cute. It does have a little Etsy on the front here. I can totally see me using this as like my, like an on-the-go bag in my purse. So far, I don't own a purse. I own a cell phone wallet. Because that's me. But I'll eventually go back to a purse that I won't put a makeup bag in because I don't put, I don't do my makeup on the go. I usually do my makeup like before I go out and then we go out for the hour or two that we're out and then I come home and then it just sits on my face. So, and even when I was at work, I would just take like a lipstick with me because, I don't know, I just never really had to touch up my makeup when I was at work. Because I wear, like, heavy-duty, you know. There's a dog over there. Oh, why are you always in my shots? Do you, can you see him? Here's my little brown baby. What are you doing, Oda McGee? We see you. Oh, stretching puppy. Oh, my goodness. I can hear Loki. He's going. I can... Oh, Jimmy Key! You can barely see him right, right there. Here he comes. Here he comes. Here he comes. Nope. He decided to lay down and say, "Screw mom." Yeah. So let's find out. Oh, so this is what comes in the actual bubble mailer. It didn't actually come inside. Uh, so it's called the sheet is bananas. B A N A S. The shit. Is bananas B A N A N A S. That's such a good song. It makes you want to get up and dance. Anyways, it says that this is um, hyaluronic acid. Step one: apply mask to clean face. Step three: chill for 15 to 20 minutes. Snap a selfie and share with you. Share the phone with friends. I won't be doing that. Uh, remove. I probably will put it on and and just share it with my friend. But I'm not gonna. Put, post it on inner Instagram or anything and then it says remove mask and reveal glowing skin now this one is hyaluronic acid and it's hydrating uh, this one is volcanic ash and it says you can't handle this sheet uh, and this is from volcanic this is like I said volcanic ash and it's purifying so I'm basically the same thing if you if you I don't know how well you can see that but it shows like it's gonna have like the name of the sh of the sh sheet mask on top, and like little fire symbols. I'm really really hoping that's true. So and then I got another. Uh... You're gonna kill yourself, cat. She has all these like scabs all over her body from her digging herself because she's itchy, and I think that she's itchy from the stuff outside the um what is it the bark dust outside i think it gets into her fur and then it gets worked down into her skin and then it itches and she itches and she digs 
and then she starts to pull on her hair, and she has she has these like little seizures when she hits a nerve, and she starts literally she has a seizure and falls over, and it scares me. And I've already taken her to the vet, and the vet basically said that she needs to have a cortisone shot and flea meds on, and she was doing better. I mean, the last time I took her to that, it cost $98, and I'm not saying that I don't mind, it's not, it's not that I don't like paying that much money for the cat, I, I didn't, but I did, I still did it, but if it's just an itchy problem, then it needs to be dealt with in a different way, I can't keep having her, I can't pay the 40, I'm, I'm not going to pay the $41 every time I have to take her to the vet for, uh, for the for this problem it's an ongoing problem and I'm not gonna pay it $41 that's expensive first off $41 like low for instance the vet that I and it, it's a, they're a really good bet so I don't know but she I need to have her put in the have a cortisone shot anyways enough about my cat having seizures and falling on the floor she's not really having a seizure because the minute she hits the floor she usually stops because you know she's got the crap knocked out of her anyways so this is the, the i think it's miss glam or some some glam it's just another one of those uh brushes i'm eventually going to have the whole dang set um, which is fine, I guess. I like brushes, so I'm not mad. But it's a nice fluffy brush. It's an SB68. I wonder if SB stands for shadow brush. It, it is good. I'm not, my eyelids are greasy, so I'm not going to do that. But this is what it looks like. It has those little gems right there. It's really cute and sparkly. Okay. And now for the inside of the bag. So three products came because I've already showed you the sheet masks and the brush. So that's this one is automatically going to my friend. This is the Jersey Shore Cosmetics Star Mint Glossy Balm. I don't like mint. If it was any other flavor or any other thing, I would probably use it, but I don't like mint. So that's gonna go to my friend Caitlin. And this one I was excited about, and it actually. I put it on my, because when I, I remember, I filmed this first. I put it on my hand at one point, and I, you know, rubbed it in, and it did not oxidize. So, it's a little bit, like, a skosh tad darker than I am, which is fine. Um, most foundations don't match me. I, there's very few match me but this is the Tarte Amazonian Clay 12 Hour Full Coverage Foundation. I've been wanting to try it. It does have an SPF of 15. And then this is the thing I was surprised about. This is called Ola Neon. And uh, this is the color uh, DF. I don't know what that means. Uh, but it's free of parabens, gluten, phthalates, and it's never tested on animals which I put, I put lipstick, lipstick on my dogs before. So this is a velvet liquid lipstick, matte, long-lasting, and moisturizing, and this is in a neon container. Uh, I did swatch this on my hand when I filmed it earlier, and it stayed through my nap, and then I was washing my hands because I'm making meatloaf for dinner, and I had to like really rub it in my hand, and it's crazy. I always look at look at my my myself in the camera filming, so I always look like I'm looking <laughs> not at you guys, and I am so sorry for that. I'll try to do better. I'll try to do better. So like I said, this is the color India, but look at this packaging. This is some great packaging. The look of it, the feel of it is kind of cheap feeling, but like this is amazing. I don't care what anybody says. Like I said, like it does feel cheap, but it, it looks expensive and amazing. So, I'm not going to put it on because I did notice something weird. So, when you pull it out of the thing, it's kind of bent. Now, I'm wondering if it's supposed to be that way. I mean, I'd have to get more to see, but can you see the small bend in it? 
Like, I wonder if it's just supposed to help the application. I don't know. But. And then it really is a pretty color, and I probably will wear it. I'm not a nudes fan, but it's not nude. It's more of a deep mauve. Mauve? Mauve? I hate when people say mauve. Because it looks like mauve. I hate the English language. Anyways, guys, that is it. I know that you are still waiting for the LA Colors palettes, and I swear to you that I will do that. I will do that uh, in about a week. Next video you see should be that one. Um, unless something else pops up. But I keep pushing it back because of the things come up, like my Ipsy bag. I wanted to do it before... Um, at the end of January, because it actually didn't come until the 22nd, which is today for me, but it'll be a couple, it'll be about a week for you, maybe, I don't know. But, and yeah, this dries down that, so, well, a little bit, I mean, I hadn't given it full down, uh, dry down time. So, anything else I can say to you guys, um... If you guys have any ideas for me, let me know. As long as they're not too crazy expensive, I can do them. Like, I can't do a full face of NYX or a full face. All I did do a full face of Wharton Wild because, well, that's what I can afford. Um, I could probably do a full face of ELF, but I'd rather not just because I don't like ELF. I think I have no products from them. Maybe. I think I have... Uh, Moisture and a uh, setting spray, and I don't like it. I got it, op the bottle opened, and I've actually have it on camera where they're, or film, whatever you want to call it, where they're, I'm spraying it, and it's basically, I'm, the water that I'm squirting is just, it's crazy. Anyways, um, so Elf is out of the question. I don't like any of their products. Um, let's see here. What else could I do? I mean, I still do dolls and stuff like that. There are some new dolls that have come out that I think are kind of cool that I would like to <clears throat> introduce you guys to, but that means that I have to keep them, and Barbies are okay, but other dolls, like the hair adorables, I'm, I get rid of those things after I... I get them because I don't appreciate I, I don't I appreciate them for what they are but I don't appreciate them they just kind of sit on my on my on a shelf or in a box that I just kind of toss and eventually it goes down to the laundry room for the little kids to pick through I mean that's kind of it so any videos or challenges that you guys can think of that I haven't done um let me know and I will try to do them the best that I can with my limited capabilities because my computer won't read SD cards anymore. So I can't use like a camera and I can't do anything. I can't do nothing, you guys. <gasps> okay. I love you guys so much and I will see you in my very next video. Remember to stay strong, be beautiful, and always be you. Uh, subscribe, comment, and like up this video. It helps me. If you don't like it, for whatever reason, Give me a thumbs down and tell me why you didn't like it so that way I can improve and maybe, just maybe, I will one day be on the recommended page. I doubt it. I think you have, to, I only have like 144 subscribers. And thank you all for being here and staying here. I love you all. Alright, bye guys!